Hey and welcome back. In this video tutorial, we're going to take a look on the difference between the V-Ray for SketchUp and the Lumion that works with SketchUp. So I'm super ex excited for this video. So let's get started. For this comparison, I used this 3D model of um, a house on a cliff that I used, uh, I built for a competition, a rendering competition. And um, I, I thought this is optimized for checking Lumion, and I did it already with V Ray. So I'll show you the results. This is the V Ray render. Um, a lot of it is uh, made in uh, Photoshop and post production. I'll show you the breakdown. I have a, t a whole video about it, I'll put the, the, the link in the description. So this is the breakdown, basically, um, you can see the layers, I added all the stuff. I add, there is a whole video that explains about what we did here, so I'm not going to go into depth. But this is an uh, V-Ray, I like the result, I think it's uh, pretty nice. For the U Lumion, I used the uh, Lumion 7, the educational version, I don't own the Pro yet, but uh, you can see what I got. Okay, so to be honest with you and fair, um, it's not exactly a matching because, uh, you know, one of them is a video and one is stills. Okay, so let's see some video rendered by V-Ray. Okay, so in conclusion, uh, I want, uh, what, for my experience, I had uh, some problems rendering uh, videos with V-Ray. I had some uh, frames that lost some proxy materials or something like that. I was in V-Ray 2 and on V-Ray 3.4 it's beta so I had uh, SketchUp crashing in the middle like on frame 12 or something like that. If you uh, have a solution for that drop it in the comments. And uh, I, I I got to do a good video a good video in um, Lumion, but uh, I think it's less realistic, and uh, also rendering images is less realistic on Lumion than V-Ray. So, my opinion and conclusion: if you are shooting for doing uh, stills, ima stills images, uh, you should uh, definitely go for the V-Ray. V-Ray is more realistic and have a lot of support. But uh, if you are thinking on doing um, uh, something like uh, videos and stuff like that, and uh, another thing, a very important thing about uh, the Lumion, that uh, rendering time is very short. Uh, for that uh, whole video that I render, it took less than an hour uh, to render, and that's pretty impressive. And I uh, used the uh, um, graphic uh, graphics card so if you have a good graphics card so that's great so uh, thank you for watching guys and I would like to know what you guys would like to see more uh, if you would like more Lumion maybe we can do like uh, some tutorials on Lumion uh, if you would like some uh, the new uh, V-Ray 3.4 so uh, just drop in the comments thank you for watching like and subscribe <laughs>